The majority of Alabama teachers are concerned about beginning the school year in the classroom with more cases popping up. WVTM 13's Chip Scarborough talked to one educator about the difficulty of having a normal school year in the middle of a pandemic. Some central Alabama teachers are just days away from returning to their classrooms for the first time in months. A new survey from the Alabama Education Association found nearly two thirds of the state's teachers don't feel comfortable teaching in their classrooms this fall. I think that's a very good and accurate description. That's what we're hearing from our members. Also, I think teachers have been left out of the process of back to school planning. Teachers are uneasy since it's not clear what measures will be taken to protect both teachers and students. They just don't feel that it is safe at this point. Part of Governor Kay Ivey's newly amended safer at home order includes the requirement of face masks in all schools and colleges for students in second grade and above. And while that gives some teachers reassurement, they say social distancing in schools will be extremely difficult. The way we do school, it just cannot happen. With the limited resources, with limited space, social distancing is not going to happen. And I think everybody has to go into it understanding that they are going to be exposed to the virus. Some central Alabama law enforcement officers and first responders have been eligible for hazard pay during the pandemic. Leaders with the Central Alabama American Federation of Teachers say they think teachers should be eligible for the same benefits. In Birmingham, Chip Scarborough, WVTM 13.